Many people are tempted by the high returns promised, but cash savings offer much greater protection and other forms of investment have more flexibility, as shares, funds and retail bonds can be traded. If you do buy mini bonds, carry out thorough research and spread your risk across multiple companies. Then, if one firm fails, not all your cash will be at risk. Has the new savings allowance killed ISAs? Is it still worth saving in a cash ESO now that the personal savings allowance exists? SB, via email since April 2016 Basic rate taxpayers have been able to earn £1,000 a year in savings interest without being taxed, thanks to the new personal savings allowance. For higher rate taxpayers the allowance is £500. Some say this has made the tax-free cash ESA redundant, as you would need a large savings pot to use all of the new allowance. Using the top one-year savings rate, Adam Bank's 1.95%, as an example, a basic rate taxpayer would need about £52,000 in the account before they started to be taxed on their interest. For a higher rate taxpayer the figure would be £26,000, savings in a cash ESA are not subject to tax, regardless of how much you have saved. However, the rates offered by these accounts are generally lower. Top 1 Year Fixed Rate Cash ESA, from Bank of Cyprus UK, pays 1.51%.